So now the maps are baked. You can see them in texture set settings. Uh, I'm now on this um, blin one, which is this guy here. And um, it has now different maps, normal map, nothing information there. World space normal, that's a new information. ID, nothing there. Ambient occlusion, okay, there's information there. That's a new, a new stuff we can use. Uh, curvature, super important. Now it knows which parts are curved. So the edges are curved. And then, uh, that I don't care now that much, thickness. There's a thickness map here also. I can use that, uh, that to my, let's find if I can find something useful for it. It could like, I could, for example, change the color of this uh, depending on the thickness that it would be like more hot here because it's uh, there's less material there okay but that's uh, what we just did these maps and they are all counted from the uh, from these like the geometry here and now when I did that I can use uh, I can use some of them and my goal was to have the edges worn and for that I go to layers I can use the same fill layer here and create a generator a generator that uses the edges so created a generator for this information and now I add a metal edge wear generator. And just like that, it knows how to wear, wear my edges. So now all of all of the edges on this part, which is only this area here, have wear on them. So that was useful information from the maps.